All right, hey people of the internet, sorry for that interruption, but I'm really loving the song Electric Feel, I don't know about you. All right, so today's video is gonna be about modeling 101. I'm gonna let you know how to get started, I'm gonna let you know the pros, the cons, and I am gonna get you signed if you think you have that potential. All right, so first of all, let's talk about how I got started. I'm gonna tell you right now how I got started. So, I would just like to say, Friends play a big factor into this. Have you ever been told you're really tall and you're really skinny? All right, then modeling is probably for you. So I would definitely, definitely, definitely grab one of your friends because this is exactly what I did. Have them take some supernatural digitals of you, which means supernatural, clean looking pictures and form fitting clothing. And then you're gonna do like a profile. So you're gonna get like the side of your face you're gonna do a straight on one, so you're just gonna go very straight on. Um, some full body, some waist up, and then that's pretty much what you're gonna do for that part. All right, so yeah, once you find out your legitimate agencies, which I'm sure you've heard of the big names, we've got IMG, Will, Amina next, but there isn't just that. There are a ton of agencies, and I know that even if you don't live in a modeling market, like say you live in Alabama or Texas or something, there will be an agency. And so pretty much what you wanna do is you wanna try and sign with them. And if you sign with them, then they can hopefully send you to LA or New York, the big modeling markets. All right, and one of the next things, like I said, how tall do you have to be? Let me tell you. For most modeling agencies, if you want an agency, you need to be probably at least 5'7", and that's mainly for print work. Um, but for runway, you need to be at least 5'9", like 6 feet. Um, and some agencies, if you're 5'6", you may be able to do it if you have an ordinary look about yourself, or not ordinary, I mean like different look about yourself. So honestly, that would be super cool. But honestly, there's Kate Moss. You got all these models that may not be the tallest, but if you got a look, I would even try it. But probably 5'6", five, 5'6", six, five, six is definitely the minimum of the minimum. So now we're gonna talk about legitimate agencies. So there are a ton of agencies out there that are a scam, they want your money. You see them at the mall, they approach you at an amusement park, a concert. And not all of those scouts are legitimate. Um, pretty much any agency that wants you to pay money up front, like that's no good. Um, honey, like, if an agency wants you, should they just take your money? No, I, I don't think so. I think that if they want you, you should be making money for them. All right, another very important thing about modeling is, do you eat healthy? Do you work out often? Ooh, I haven't been to the gym in like a couple weeks, man. Ooh, okay, so definitely health and fitness. That is super important. When you sign with an agency or if you sign with an agency every couple months, they normally take your measurements and that is crucial because if they are off, you are gonna need to tone up and you are gonna have to lose those inches. You're gonna have to lose the inches and I know it sucks, but if this is something you really wanna do, you need to consider that. The next thing about modeling that's super important is you have to be comfortable within your own skin. You gotta be comfortable behind the camera. My first shoot was so uncomfortable, but ever since, it's been a world of difference. You're gonna wanna practice posing in the mirror, you're gonna wanna look up videos, you're gonna need to watch other models' Instagrams, and honestly, that helps so much, and just looking around for inspiration, that is so important, and it'll really help you. Another thing that's super important if you wanna get into modeling is, do you have a fear of rejection? Because that isn't a good thing. Modeling is 90% rejection. Um, it's very hard. You're gonna need to grow some thick skin for this one, but you just gotta think there's always the next one. I wasn't meant to be. If you don't have some certain color hair, you don't got the eyes, you don't got the face, say like I'm um, dark hair, like you can't control that. So definitely you're just gonna need to be able to handle the rejection because that is a big part of modeling. There are so many great models out there and even they still get rejected. All right, so something that I even do and I shouldn't do is compare myself to other models. It is so hard to not compare yourself because there are so many great top models or they might get that job. They might be working for Nordstrom. They might be working for Topshop. They might be working for Forever 21, but who cares, okay? You need to find that quality about you. You gotta find it. Do you, I got a cool bone structure? Do I got some cool eyes? What about you is different? Are you super tall? 
are you super thin and it's like a really cool edgy look? Well, honestly, whatever it is, you need to find that about you and that is how you stick to it. Don't compare. You gotta love yourself. Like I said before, you gotta find that quality. What is unique about you? Um, like your nationalities, that is so cool. And you are yourself, you're not, you don't look exactly like that model. So if you look a lot like them, you're still not them, you know, that's so cool. Um, another thing I'd like to talk about, modeling is fun. It is not all this. It is a lot of fun. How cool is it getting your makeup done, your hair done, wearing all these cool clothes and getting those pictures back is one of the best feelings in the world. Another amazing thing about modeling is you get to work with the most amazing people, photographers, makeup artists, stylists. Honestly, it is one of the coolest things and honestly, I am so blessed that I'm able to do this and modeling is my passion. It's one of my top favorite things in my life. And honestly, if you want to do it, go for it. You may be rejected, but there's always next time. There is tons of different agencies. You can even do freelance, which is when you contact companies and you contact places and photographers to shoot with you. Like there is always ways. So I am currently signed with No Ties Management. Um, they're located in San Diego, California. I've been with them for a little over a year and honestly modeling is my favorite thing. I, it's my escape, it's so cool. It's like I can just let go of my stress. I get to meet the most amazing people and it is one of my favorite things in life and I wanna continue it as a career. So if you have any questions that I didn't cover, you can just leave it in the comment section down below and I would absolutely love to answer them because I know how exciting this is. So honestly, if you wanna do it, grab your friend, get out there and take some pictures and submit to those agencies. Go on those casting calls. All right, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.